Hey everybody, uh, it's Marlene Potts from Balloon Masters in Buffalo, New York. And I wanted to share with you a little thing. I had a delivery in a mall. Um, I'm not gonna be on camera very long because I don't look very good today, but I want to talk to you a little bit about retail um, and pop-up shops. And we're gonna go through a little bit here uh, in the mall or in your town, there are a lot of stores closing and you know, things were, are readjusting, reopening. Um, it's actually kind of an exciting time. But when we first started, <clears throat> Chris and I would buy entire stores. We'd buy their whole fixtures when they were going out of business. Uh, our best deal was we bought an entire Hallmark store for $500, all the fixtures. And what I'm talking about fixtures, I'm not just talking about the floor fixtures, I'm talking about the wall fixtures. So if you come into malls, here, like here, I see all these, these are professional grade shelving strips. And in the back, they will have all the hardware and all the shelves for this. You could make an offer, like for a dollar for each one of these strips. Now you have to return, you have to remove them, but you get all the shelving. Like I bet they would take $100. You take all these strips down, they'd give you the shelving and the hooks for them. Now this is great if you maybe you're remodeling a room or your garage and you want to put shelves up um, or maybe you do yard cards and you want to put hooks at the top and hang your yard cards down right it gives you a lot of different options here look at this great counter you could probably pick up for a steal this is this this is all i can see is oh my god if i was opening another store i'd have that counter in a second or look up and the track lighting this is all custom beautiful track lighting that you could take down and install in your your home your store um what, what you know whatever you're doing to, you know obviously based on it you might not maybe not your home but i don't know maybe you have a showroom but i just wanted to take you through a couple of these empty stores and show you that your their pain could be your gain we also when we first started bought out a radio shack and we bought all the slat wall slat wall is expensive if you took this down, you'd be amazed. They'd practically give it to you for free. See all that stuff in the back? Look at all the shelving in the back. And in the back room, they have all the brackets and shelving for this stuff. You could just get this so simple and start up a little, a little home-based business. Maybe you're going to turn your garage into a little studio where people can come pick up your stuffed balloons, um, your balloon decorations. Now, this is a little different. <clears throat> this is a little darker. These countertops right here, these are nice. See, these are good for kiosk sales, pop-up shops, right? Just roll that right out of a, a truck, and now you've got a place for your cash register and uh, bagging items, that type of thing. Now, this used to be a Things Remembered, <clears throat> and this lady actually got, look, look at it. She's renting month to month, and she's got a little store here, and she all these fixtures came with the store. Now, she just rented this, so she doesn't get to keep these, but um, she could, in the end, she could just make them an offer. But this is great because if you're doing work almost full time at your house, maybe it is time to branch out a little bit. Malls are renting very, very cheaply right now, but it's only on a month to month basis because they don't know what's happening. Look at this. You could come pick up these. You know how expensive these are? If you did t-shirts, if you're doing any type of press on t-shirts, custom made things, vinyl, look at this shelving. You know, all this beautiful glass shelving, all these fixtures, these cabinets. I'm, I would even take these chairs. Look at those nice, those nice chairs over there. They must have just remodeled, right? Look at all that stuff. If I did any type of vinyl graphics on clothing or hot pressing, anything, I would totally buy all of this. Look at these nice counters. Look at this. Now that's good. Like that's good. This is good balloon storage, right? You can just even stack the balloons in there. Like pink, yellow, blue, green, right? Anything, even for your house. Now, of course, this over here is a salon. And, you know, I don't need anything here. But I like these fixtures. Look at those nice white light fixtures. So when somebody comes back in to rent this store, they have to throw all this stuff out. Or somebody comes in and cleans them out. There's also, the malls also have tons of, of the fixtures that sit in the middle. They usually have an empty store that all of it is in and you can make an offer and I'm talking cheap and really get nice glass cases, um, all kinds of things. So when you're looking to expand, you know, you have a little bit of a budget and I'll tell you those Hallmark um, fixtures that we bought, we used 
oh my God, for 20 years, I literally still use the drawers in my office today. It was one of the best purchases ever. And at the time, I could have never, I mean, these, this costs $100,000 sometimes to have these things. Look at these nice counters. So that's my little tip for today. Keep your eyes open. Uh, don't, afraid, don't be afraid to buy fixtures at auctions. Visit these malls, get to know them. They can be excellent places for your next business venture when you try to go and expand. Um, have a great day and we'll see you again soon. Bye.